am Lisa Scottolini and welcome to my big book party. Woohoo! We heard that if we all got our picture taken with the book club holding the book, that would be entered to come to the house. So we did it. Yes, this is our first time here and we're really excited. This is it, this is the first time. Are you excited to do this? Absolutely, yeah. I probably am the only author on the planet to invite my readers to their house and I don't know any other way to do it. We're from the Traveling Book Club from Eaton Rapids, Michigan. Our readers really do know us, so it's wonderful to get to know them. Where are you guys from? Uh, she's from South Bend, Indiana. What book club is this? Hi, we're the Hi Book Club. We're the Red Hat Readers. And we're the Book Club Dollies. Oh my God, how you doing? <laughs> I came all the way to Central Pennsylvania to be here. I wouldn't have missed it. We're, We're the, the babbling books. I am hooked on Lisa. Let's go! You look fabulous. <laughs> She's crazy. She's Italian. What could be bad? <laughs> we take a picture. Three, two, one, cheese! Me, Me, an Emotional Baggage Claim is like all of the books in the series about a mother and daughter relationship. And we like to keep it real. I mean, I think these are the only books around that really deal with what it is like to be a mother and your difference and how your role has to morph to keep close to your child even as she goes farther away. I can relate to a lot because I'm just about her age and her daughter's probably my daughter's age so I can relate to her a lot. I have another book coming out in April which for me is a huge departure because this time it is a male main character. What happens is this guy is an amazing guy. He's actually a, a surgeon in, the, in Afghanistan. And while he was away, his wife is killed. And also, when he comes home, he has a young daughter. So the question in Don't Go is, can a great father be as great as a great mother? Is it really about gender? And so if you've never met us before or been to a signing, didn't you know we were going to be like this? <laughs> that's because the books are true and real. And that's what books do. I feel very lucky that we get to tell the stories. But the truth is, I think it's the story of, of all of our lives. I really are forever grateful that you do that. So thank so, you very, very thank much. You so much. I never would have expected to be able to come to an author's house like this and meet them and hang with them and it's an amazing experience.